Getty Image Smart 27, 2019 The Tampa Bay Rays opened their season against the Houston Astros this week sans three of the four hitters that reached double digits in home runs for them last season. That, in itself, is a big deal. Only one of them reached 15, that was CJ. Cron, dumped and headed to the Minnesota Twins. Shortstop Willie Adames is the leading returning power hitter with 10, which is, frankly, amazing, even for this franchise. Still, I cannot wait to see how things turn out with this offense, which features several fantasy sleepers. As the MLB season gets underway in earnest, these are the pitchers to keep a close eye on. Their fantasy value could change quite a bit based on early performances. Fantasy baseball is a game about ceilings and floors, which means sometimes you have to take a chance and make a bold prediction. Here's our Tristan H. Cockcroft's biggest calls for the season ahead. Following an injury to their starting second baseman, the Cincinnati Reds will have to make some changes heading into the opening week of the season. How will that impact your fantasy drafts? Third baseman Matt Duffy starts out on the injured list for a few weeks, meaning the Rays have room for one of the infielders I find interesting that might not have been in the plans for regular playing time. First baseman G-Man Choi slugged .536 versus right-handed pitching last season. He should play. Brandon Lowe slugged .613 at AAA Durham and just signed a six-year contract reminiscent of Scott Kingery, so he should play. Yandy Diaz has yet to slug much, and the Cleveland Indians might not think he will after they traded him for Jake Bowers, but give it time. Subscribe to ESPN to get access to all premium articles, fantasy tools, plus thousands of live sporting events and ESPN originals for just $4.99 per mo. To help make this website better, to improve and personalize your experience and for advertising purposes, are you happy to accept cookies and other technologies? More info here cookie choices.